Well, happy Thursday and welcome back to the Average Fisherman, guys. <sighs> Unloading the kayak. Ooh. Today, just going out to do some simple pan fishing. Water looks pretty tannic but clear and uh, pretty calm right now. Temperature is going to be in the upper 80s. I have a beetle spin type setup and two just bobber setups that I'm going to be using today. Um, just trying to keep it simple. I'm just going to go out and try to catch a few bluegills just for the hell of it. Clear my head before the funeral tomorrow. So that's that's what you see. Just my normal, normal bluegill type setup here. Already getting a bunch of sand gnats flying around me, so anxious to get on the water, get away from those things. So let's get in there. Let's see what we can do. First fish of the day. Decent little bluegill. Yeah, nice little guy. Not really what I'm after, but. adjust my camera here so you guys can see. Oh, he got off. They're slow hitting. I think it'll pick up once the sun comes out a little bit. He's literally just letting it sit there. Yeah, it's going to be one of those where they're super positional. So that that cast was about a foot away from, <laughs> from where they were. And they didn't want it. So there we go. Slow fishing this morning, but that's okay. I, mean, I just need to get out the house. Just a pile of these little tiny fish. Just all kind of small fish today. In my lap. Oh, come on. And he made it to the bottom of the boat. Oh, well. Another little guy. Catching fish, not complaining, not complaining at all. First decent sized one in a while here. Let me back the boat up. There we go. There you go. That's a good one. Yeah. It's a decent little fish. Had another one. I think I found a pile of like little four or five inch fish here. 
It's okay. I'll take it. There you go. Good fighter. Pull and drag. All right, first keeper. There you go, first keeper. Oh, decent little fish. Not keeper size, but. Yeah. Oh, going back. Good fighter here. Good little fish here. We're putting up a fight. <laughs> nice little bluegill. Let's throw him back. Another nice one. Probably the biggest one all day. Look at that. Nice fish. Keep him. All right, let me back off a little bit because I'm throwing right out there, right off the left side of the nose of the kayak. Let me adjust the camera. Here we go. Good fight, good fight. Yeah, another nice one. This this is a little bigger than the last one. Yeah. Only one about six fish. I'm not looking to clean house or anything. We go. Yeah, throw back. Decent size, but not what I'm after. Just gotta let it sit and just kind of slowly taking it under. <laughs> there we go. Bluegill is so much fun. It really is, guys. I missed catching this one on camera. But that's another nice one. About at my six fish limit already.
Well, all right, guys, I think that's going to about do it for me. I have enough fish. I've been on here about two and a half, three hours. Plus, these stupid gnats are freaking terrible. They get in my eyes and everything else. So, note to self, it's that time of year where it's time to bring vanilla spray for the gnats. So, anyway, I did what I came to do. So, no regrets. And, you know, beautiful day on the water. Can't really say anything. It's just, um, yeah, plus I'm getting tired, which sucks because I've only been here for an hour and a half, two hours. But, like I said, my level of fatigue still seems to be my limiting factor. So. Anyway, we got a couple big bluegills, five, maybe six of them, which is all I really wanted. So, successful day in my book. I'm going to take it to the ramp, pack up the kayak, and head on home. Hope you guys have a better week than I've been having. And then, um, yeah, got to get ready for the funeral tomorrow. So, anyway, hope you guys have a good weekend. Tight lines, my friends.